welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is Brene. If you don't know, if you have not seen my face and you've seen this on your whatever, um, go to my video so you can see who I am. I am going to be doing my extra curve, extra long, longest of the long nails. Um, I will be speeding some parts up because I will be listening to music. And I don't want to get copyrighted, so I'm going to try to explain the best way I know how. Um, and yeah, y'all, so let's just go ahead and get into the video. So a couple things I know that I will need, of course, is a drill. This is the brand that I have. You can get it from Amazon. Of course, I use it. I make sure I have a towel so my paper towels won't get stuck or whatever i personally use these type of towels that you can get from walmart anywhere for real it's like in the car section of the plate of walmart or whatever and then um i do always have some acetone um of course my monomers which is this is young nails and then i use mia secret I use both of these. My brush is, these you can't even tell, these are so old. I use these, these are um, Kalinsky brushes. I believe they're 16. I actually just recently bought another one, which is, I think this one is um, a 14 brush. So I will be using this today. This is size 14, so you guys can see. I got this from Amazon, so I will be using this brush today as well. I'd be using both of the brushes, and this is the size, so that's 14, and this is the size 16, just for reference. Let's see. And here are my powders. This is Young Nails Powder. This is in Core French Pink. I probably will be mixing this pink with the Cover New by Mia Secret. I'll be mixing these two as my base colors, and of course, the Cover Clear I use from Mia Secret as well. And then, I mean, from Young Nails, I'm sorry, from Young Nails as well. And then I always have my Young Nails Swipe. I, As you can see, I love Young Nails. <laughs> so, let's just go ahead and get into it. My nails are pretty much all right. They're not really bad, but they need to be prepped. So, what I like to do is I like to take my file and like to leather or feather my nail i do have two greeny nails which mean water got underneath my nails this one i already knew i was going to have one because if you watch my previous vlogs you've seen that i actually one a part of my nail was coming up and it wouldn't like no matter if i glued it down didn't glue it down it would not stay down so when i as i wash my hands water got into it or whatever but it's okay it's fine um like i said it actually gotten better i put um medicine on it so that's fine don't do what i do y'all i wouldn't suggest you to do unless your green nail is is pretty much almost healed like mine is i wouldn't suggest you to um do your nails when you have a greenie but anyway i'm gonna do it regardless <laughs> okay so yeah so i just la feather it like that you know what i'm saying And here are my dapping dishes. I use two of them because one has one is gonna have my monomer in it, and the other one's gonna have acetone in it. So I am about to clean them. I'm gonna use my acetone to clean them.
Yeah, look at my hair is. I'm probably gonna put some swipe in here. It seemed like the swipe cleaned it much better than the daggone acid on did. It's probably because it's probably freaking um, acrylic in the acetone. Because there's no way that that just cleaned better. Also, I have a couple polishes out here that I don't know what I'm going to use. So I just like to keep it out just in case. I don't know what colors I'm going to use, guys. I didn't even show you guys my protein bond and my okay so here's i didn't show you guys my preps so here is my nail prep dehydrator i use model ones this is what i use i'm not sure you guys can see it i use that then i use it's so nasty and so dirty but then i use the this is the nail primer and also for some extra support and extra no lifting. I also use the Young Nails Protein Balm. So I love that too. So those are my favorite ones to use. Um, so let's just go ahead and get started. I'm probably going to speed some of these parts up. So you guys are just going to have to watch to grasp on what I'm doing. And I will come back so you won't be as confused on what I'm doing. Again, if you have any type of questions, leave them in the comment section down below. For my glue, I use KDS glue. Currently 814. Hopefully this doesn't take me long, guys, because I do know that my, like I said, I've, this is a little bit of TMI, but my stomach has been hurting me so, so, so bad, y'all. And honestly, what am I about to do? And honestly, I don't know, like, I don't know what's going on, and I'm trying to, like, wait to see if I have to go again. That's what's taking me so long, really. So, oh, yeah, and then on the drill, it gives you the option forward or reverse. Forward, you always go with your right hand, and reverse, you always go with your left hand. I believe. Don't quote me, but I know that that's how I learned it because I'm right-handed. It's just how I remember it. And it gives you the numbers on here. Forward, and I'm going 9 RPMs. So, what I what I showed y'all with the, um, the file, you don't even necessarily have to do this. I'm just doing this just because I'm a very extra person. And I like to make sure I have nothing, when I say nothing... Nothing on my nail plate. So. I'm a very extra person. You don't need to do this step. As long as you do. Your. Prep with your. E, with your file. You don't need to e-file it. have this little thing to wipe out my nails off and then I will take my young nails and I take this brush to pretty much make sure I get all the stuff off my nails before I prep my nails 
now that the tips are on we are about to get ready to go ahead and um get started guys i'm so excited my tips are on all right so here i already added my thin layer of acrylic down and prepped already you already see my prep and that's what i use then i'm going to use my um, mia secret cover new and mix that with the what color is that cover french pink and we're gonna get started y'all
So here's my application only. Yeah, it's a little lumpy or whatever, but of course we're going to file that and make sure we get that done. I normally don't cap them, but sometimes I do just for extra thickness of my nails.
Ouch. My nails are gross. Oh, oh. I'm gonna ask him to grab something.
Alrighty, so yo, I decided to do a French tip. As you can see, I did change the tools. I got that little brush from Amazon, I believe. Um, and I'm just filling in the spaces that need to be filled in pretty much. Y'all know I love the French and I will forever do French. Um, I had a moment where I was doing just, um, what was it? I forgot what it was, um, ombre, and now I'm in love with French, so, yeah, I wiped the sides off so it won't look too, too bulky or whatever, so, yeah, wipe the sides off, cure it, do two coats of that, and then do the rest of my fingers, pretty much, so that's what I do.
okay. <sighs> my back hurt, my butter, my bro to set my booty shake, but I don't do it. Okay, okay, babe. You enjoying a little too much. Alright, watch out. My nails are done. video it might be short it might be long I don't know but yeah I'm done hope you guys enjoyed watching me um go crazy on this video y'all already know I like junk nails if it's not junk nails there's no nails period and yeah so I hope you guys like comment subscribe to my youtube channel turn on notification so you'll be notified whenever I do post a video I love you guys bye